Hey there my dudes, how's it going? Hope you're all doing well today. Welcome back to the next instalment in the Hollow Knight Voidheart blind playthrough series. So, bring you up to speed. Last time on Hollow Knight Voidheart, <laughs> we were over here, so we had finished off the distant village and deep nest and stuff, and I said that I was going to make my way back all the way across here. Well, basically, what I did was I did get back to the tram and I went back. And then I went to the place where we will be going. And it was really straightforward. And then it was like, oh, okay, this area here, this is the next thing. So I ran away. <laughs> well, I didn't run away. I was just like, right, I'm not going to do that just yet. So I then realized I had a lot of money on me. And I went back to Dirtmouth and found that there was nothing I could buy. So I thought, okay, I'll go and see the banker lady, wherever she was, around the King Station, I think it is, or Queen Station, one of the two, anyway. Uh, yeah, Queen Station, I think. And she's not there anymore. She's, like, disappeared. And so that means all the money I banked with her has vanished. So I'm hoping she's going to show up again somewhere. So then I was like, right, well, I need to try and spend this money. Ah, I know, I'll go and see the big jolly fat bug lady that lives over here, where I am at the moment. And I was able to go and see her, and I was actually able to buy a new notch. So that means that I could equip more in the way of charms. So that was cool. So I did that. And I got... Another another notch, so I was able to swap out my long nail and exchange it for the Mark of Pride, which greatly increases the range of the bearer's nail, allowing them to strike foes from further away. So I thought, that's like the longest one, so I'll put that one on. So I did that, and then the other thing I did was I almost had 500 Dream Essence, so I went back to the um, like the graveyard place where all the ghosts are, and I killed a bunch of them so it was a case of run in kill a couple run out run back in kill a couple run out and then when i had 500 i went to see the seer and she rewarded me by giving me this the dream wielder so transient charm created for those who wield the dream now and collect essence allows the bearer to charge the dream now faster and collect more soul when striking foes so that's cool and as you can see, now I only need 12, because I also stopped by that creepy bug guy. Can't remember what his name is now, but the one that looks a bit mad. And I bought the three things that he sells. So Fragile Heart, Fragile Greed, Fragile Strength. So we got them. So yeah, we only need 12, and then we've got all of the charms. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the other thing that's happened is the Forgotten Crossroads area below... I think that's what it's called, or is it Green Path? No, it is Forgotten Crossroads, yeah, this area around here. Um, it's like gone all weird. It's been sort of taken over and the enemies have tra changed. So you've now got this, you've got a slobbering husk. The body of a bug, completely consumed by infection, spits corrosive liquid. Violent husk. Maddened by massive infection, charges at enemies with no thought for its own preservation. It explodes upon impact. Volatile Gruiser. Gruiser swollen with infection and primed to burst. And these Furious Vengefly. Vengefly whose body has been distorted by continued infection. Highly aggressive. So the enemies have changed, which is interesting. So I don't know if that's a result of me breaking one of the seals or... It does seem to coincide... Because the last few other times I'd gone back to those areas, nothing like that had happened, so it's a bit weird. Anyway, so I then was like, right, I'll make my way back down, ready for the episode, go to the Ancient Basin. And on my way, I was like, ooh, what's over here? And I came through, and look. There's golden light coming out of there, and it looks to me like honeycomb or something, like a beehive. It's all drippy and stuff, so I thought we'd start here and have a look. Yep, lots of bees.
Right, okay. So is there going to be a ginormous bee enemy in here? Bee boss. Bee mama. Oh, hello. Yay, you're free. How do I get over that side then? So this was literally just to come and free the grub. There has to be another way. It's an off the map place as well, which is interesting. But there doesn't seem to be any other breaks in the floor for us to go down. Hmm. How bizarre. It's a bit of a weird one, isn't it? Right, let's just have a look. Is there... No, there's no other way though. That's the weird thing. Yeah, because this is the lowest level here. Huh. A mystery. Okay. We will solve that mystery another time. So for now, we have places to go and people to see and I've gone down the wrong bit again. That was a bit daft to me. Yeah, there's got to be another route to get in there then. It's just a case of working out where it is and how we get in there. to do that, but then mind. It worked out. Right, here's our tram. It's down for a sec. Oh, map updated. Okay, let's see if it gives us a clue then. No, it just shows the box. I mean, the only other thing I can think of then is that there's something like low. Maybe even when we go through to this area, there'll be another way and it will lead underneath and then up. Hmm. Or it's like a really long way round, so it'll be across and then down and then round that way or something. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. I love as well, though, this game is huge. Like, every time we fill out new areas and we expand the map, but then there's yet still more. Alright, do I need to go again? Why does it keep going back up to the top? No, I don't go again. This is our stop. Okay, so... Right, what have I got? Right, I'm going to take off the compass. And put something else on.
Don't even know what that does, you know. Causes the bearer to emit a heroic odour. That doesn't really tell you. So I smell. Um, should we try it and see, see what it does? Oh, that's weird. Will that, like, cause enemies to be damaged or what? Not sure if it did or whether it was just from my shield, to be honest. It might do. I'm not entirely sure. Man, I hate that bit. Right. So we can't get up there yet. Oh, oh no, I didn't mean to do that. That was silly. Alright, I think I'm going the right way. Oh, I, <laughs> I can't find out, can I? Because I took my thing off. I think it's a straight path, though. Yeah, this is the right way. So this is the stuff. You see all this? This is what... Oh. This is what was um above. It's all this weird infected stuff. It's like me, but different. It's got big horns. Oh. Something just happened. Oh, it's loads of them weird things. Broken vessel. Okay. Oh. Those weird ghost things. Oh. How much more? Oh, is that it? Did I do it? No. Oh, wait. What's going on? Did I do it? Or did I just make him mad? Oh. I did it. I did it! Yay! First time! Excellent. Excellent. 
in your face, broken vessel. Pretender to the Hollow Knight crown. I am the only, one and only Hollow Knight. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. this thing. <gasps> Consumed the monarch wings. Press X while in the air to flap the wings. Use these ethereal wings to sail above enemies and discover new paths. Finally, we can go upwards. Awesome. So it wasn't a double jump or anything, it's flying. Oh. You can only... You can't... Wait. You can only do it once. I mean, that's cool, we can fly, but... Oh, allow one to jump again in mid... Right, so it is basically just a double jump then. Oh, it's not full-on flying, that's a shame. Broken vessel. Shattered corpse reanimated by infected parasites. The shape of this creature. I've seen something like it before. More than once, perhaps. It looks a little like the bugs of Hallow Nest. But not quite the same. Where did these empty little wanderers come from? Hmm. Where indeed? Yeah, it just means that where there was a ledge before that was, like, too high, I can now get over it. Oh. Hmm. There is one thing I do know. I think it's connected to, like, the DLC stuff, or, like, the additional bits they added to the game is that because that's like dream essence I think there's a way to fight like stronger versions of some of the enemies if you hit them with the dream nail yeah I don't know whether I'm ready to take on more difficult forms of bosses quite yet to be fair Maybe we'll um we'll 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 uh, we'll leave that one <laughs> for the time being. Right, I now need to find. You would have thought that they would have given me like an up. Ah, like this. <laughs> it's gonna say that they'd give me an up where I hadn't been able to previously go, so I could test it out. But they did. Weird little puffs of whatever they are. See, that's what was... He was, like, creating those things. Oh, it's 
spiky spikies. Me no likey spiky spikies. Right, come on. Uh, utilize all the skills together now. Jump, fly. Dash, wall climb. Okay, this is going to be hard. It's to get a grub. Alright, so I need to drop, jump, fly, and something. Yes, we did it. Hooray! Another grub free. Right, so that that was that. That was that area. Okay. Cool. Right, and we can just double check now and check the map. Yeah, so that's it. That's that area done. Hmm. So now I have to think of places. I wonder if we can get into this now, that because I'm sure this was too high up. Right, let's go and have a look. Yes, it was. Ha! New place, people. Palace grounds. Walk cautiously. <laughs> Lots of spiky bits. Oh, hello, a corpse in white armor, hmm, yeah, <laughs> that's going to be a boss, where have you gone dear king? Bong. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's, it's nothing. <laughs> I thought it was a, a thing. Hidden station. <sighs> oh, what? We need 300. Oh, good. Bench. Right, by the looks of it, there's nothing else here. So my thought about this area leading through to another area doesn't seem to be accurate. Alright. <laughs> We've got a bench. So whatever goes wrong, we won't have too far back to go. Let's hit this thing with a dream now, shall we? Oh. What? Nothing happened. 
Huh. Well, that's a little disappointing. Oh, wait, what? Oh, no. How very strange. So, there's just ruins. And a armour set. <laughs> An empty suit of armour. Or, well, maybe not empty, but... And that's it. I feel slightly uh, uh, underwhelmed now, folks. Not going to lie. I was expecting bigger things. So, I need to try and get more money then. Because I want to get that stag station. Because maybe that thing's going to be something important later. Yeah, it's going to be grindy though, isn't it? Alright, well where else can we go then? Because now we've got the ability to fly upwards. There has to be other places. Because there's, there's, there's been tons of places that we passed and I was like, Oh, I wish I could double jump. Oh, I wish I could get up there. There must be something that we haven't got yet. And now I have such a thing and... Hmm... Yeah, I can't think of where any of the places are now. <laughs> yeah, look at that. I mean, 175. I need to kill a lot of those things. Yeah, you can get lost. I'm not giving you any more money. Oh. I've got to remember that I've got this double jump ability now, because I'm going to keep forgetting. Right, was there anything else, like the other side or anything? Not, not that I can... Mm. It's interesting as well that you've got this bit, but it doesn't connect up to that. So that's going to be another area that sort of runs parallel to it. Okay, so this is the tram station. not anything in the tram station area. I mean, I guess we could, while we're over here, we could maybe go and see what that is over there. So should I change my, um, get rid of that for now and put my compass back on so that we can act, act there accurately see where we're going yeah so we're there see I'm, that's that must be an up I suppose I could always go that way, rather than going across here, I could just go up there, through there, and then up the lift. 
Patita. Oh, wait. No, this is flying across stuff. Yeah. Forget that. Oh, fell down the hole. Totally intentional. I meant to do that, obviously. Press the glowing button. Okay. Right, so we are... Where are we? There we are. Right, let's try and see if we can get across to there. Hello, buzzy bees. Oh, whoops. Right, remember to collect as much of this as you can along the way, Dom. After all, you do need it. Uh, just, yeah, just, just fall down. Yeah, of course, that's, that's all part of the plan. Obviously. Who said it wasn't? <laughs> Okay, so we're on 189. <laughs> what did we need? 300. 350. About uh, 350. Uh, South Park reference there. Ah, no! Stupid bees! Oh, nothing in there. it straight up that I have to go? No. Across again, and then up. No. Not even that way. That's not where I'm going at all. I'm carrying on going straight across. Okay. It's good, isn't it? I've got no idea where I'm going. So nice as well now, just being able to go through the water and stuff, not having to worry about anything. Just, if only there was something that would mitigate the spikes. That would be the ideal thing, now that I can go in poisonous water and the like.
forgot about these annoying jumping fleas. At least I can get them from further away now. Hey, look, I've got enough. Got enough money already. Right, okay, so just cross a little bit more and then up. Okay. So we need to go up and then up. The so we can't go up that way. So up here. Oh, I can't go that way. There's one of them barriers. So whatever I need to be able to go through that, I don't have. Okay, so that's that one out. So now we need to continue going upwards. And hopefully there won't be another barrier up further. Oh, that was a bit frantic. He's like, no, just hit everything, kill everything. Okay, up again. What is this room? Not somewhere nice. And also pointless going around there. Hey, how come that didn't kill it? There we go, that did. Ah. Oh, it was to get... Oh, okay, I've already done that. Hooray for pointless. Right, I can't die. <laughs> it's not allowed. Ow. Oh, come off it. At least, uh, sometimes it's good because it sort of bumps you up. Right, how much further up? Oh, we're nearly there. Ah, so it, that's why it was a an inaccessible area. 
Right, so above is a bench, apparently. Yes. Oh. Okay, it's a big tent. Okay, and we've got, so Kingdom's Edge, and then branches off to the right. What is it? What's this? Wanderer's Journal. Kind of makes sense, I guess. That this ash trapped. Ah, oh, you can't go out that side. That's annoying. Hey, all that side. Oh, that's what they meant about the ash, about being trapped. Can't get out the top. Curiouser and curiouser. Although, wait, is the way to the right actually below me? Yeah. It is. This place is both pretty and kind of frightening at the same time. It's creepy. Oh, hello. Do I want to follow you? I don't know if I do or not. I don't know how much longer we've got left. I don't want to end up following her and it leading me down a rabbit hole. No. I think we're going to have to see what the deal is with Hornet at the beginning of the next one, guys. Because otherwise we're going to overrun and this is going to be far too long. Or it's either going to go beyond my recording limit. And I don't want it to cut out on you. So, fortuitously, we found this bench. So we are going to stay here. We're going to take a quick look at the map. Right, so it's a long... Okay. So you go all the way along there and then out to wherever. Hmm. Okay. Well, we found a new area. Anyway, I think it's been a extremely productive episode. We killed a boss at the very beginning, pretty much. Yay! We didn't have much joy with the B area, but hopefully we will eventually. We got a new ability, we found some new things, and then we've made our way to a completely new part now of Kingdom's Edge. I feel happy. I feel like we've done good. Hopefully you agree. And if you agree, and you think that this was good, please leave a thumbs up on the video. Please leave a like to let me know that you have indeed liked this. Please leave comments down below if you're enjoying the series so far, if you've got any thoughts, uh, anything you think I should be doing, anywhere that you go, oh, yeah, Dom, go back to this place because now you have the thing you can do the thing with, you might be able to do another thing. Lots of words starting with thing there. And, um, yeah, that kind of thing. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, please. That would be lovely and it would be great for you to play a part in expanding this ever-growing kingdom of geeks of ours. I would be extremely grateful. And obviously I'm grateful to all the rest of you that already subscribe and support me. Yeah, thank you very much for continuing to do so. And in my description box you will find the link to my Twitter. So you can come and follow and chat to me on there. And also my donation medium, should you feel generous enough to drop me a few coins to help me out. To help me 
do more with the channel and get bits and pieces it would be very much appreciated but equally you're under no obligation to so I'm just putting it out there and I will see you guys on the next one you all take care now bye bye